Hey, what's going on guys? Castor here. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to get a refund from Apple. Alright guys, so the story can be anything. Maybe one of your kid actually did this. Maybe you did it yourself. Or maybe someone else did it in your family. Someone that have access to your phone or your computer. All right. So now you see this charge and uh, maybe it's been a week or something. Uh, but you didn't do it yourself or at least you didn't mean to do it if it was you that did it. All right. So how do you go about getting your refund? Because Apple will give you a refund for this, okay? So you just have to know how to do it. And it's pretty simple. All you have to do is go to this website. Yep. All right. So uh, um, you can also click on the link uh, in the description. It's going to, uh, there'll be a hot link there that will take you directly to this site right here. So, guys, it's going to take you to this website where you have to put in your Apple ID and your password you click this arrow to connect so I'm gonna use uh, okay let's do this one two nine nine eight four zero So guys, if you have uh, the two-factor authentication enabled in your account, you're gonna have this. Or uh, you know, if you don't have, if it's not enabled on your account, you would not have to do that. Now it's br it's gonna bring in the latest application that you that you bought, okay? And you will certainly see the one that you didn't buy, you know, on top, all right? but all you got to do is just come up here which says uh what can i help you with you click this drop down you select a refund um, request a refund then you click on i didn't mean to buy this this one right here okay then you want to click next now that app will be the first one here so you just click on it all right then you push submit Okay, guys, that is all. Now it's gonna be like a waiting game, but uh, I believe it doesn't take longer than 72 hours. You're gonna have uh, your refund back to your account. And um, that's it, guys. This is how it's done. It's not complicated at all. So uh, try that. If it doesn't work the first time, um coming here could be a challenge because i don't know why but i had to try it three or four times before it went through um so just try it over over again until it lets you connect and uh it lets you put in the request for the refund all right so guys uh let me know what you think if it worked uh please let me know below and I will see you uh, in the next one. Bye-bye.